today, Davao de Oro, and to our listeners, and most especially to our learners, welcome to our presentation from Industrial Arts Track. Today, I will be going to present the specialization of electronic product assembly and servicing. I am teacher Brian G. Panimdim from Authority Orlando S. Remando National High School, Division of Davao de Oro. Join me as we explore a new lesson in EPAS specialization. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. Learners, we are now in the second quarter and third week of our lesson in Electronic Products Assembly Servicing. Today, we will be discussing about the parts and types of a multi-tester. The objectives of today's lessons are, at the end of this episode, the students will be able to learn how to first, enumerate the parts and types of multi-tester, second, perform how to use the multi-tester. Third, value the importance of multi-tester in learning electronics. Please get your modules and listen carefully so that you will be able to follow our discussions and learn another lessons from our specialization. But before we proceed, May I remind you of the following simple rules on how to use your modules. First, use the module with care. Do not put unnecessary marks on any part of the module. Use a separate sheet of paper in answering the exercises. Second, read the instructions carefully before doing each task. As for this episode, I will be with you as we accomplish some of the tasks and activities for the quarter two, module two of the subject EPAS. Third, observe honesty and integrity in doing the task and checking your answers. Fourth, finish the task at hand before proceeding to the next. Fifth, Return this module to your teacher or facilitator once you are through with it. Now, are you ready? Very good! I guess everything is all set. Then, let's begin. Later in our lessons, we will figure out if your answers are correct. You did great! Let's proceed to our discussion. In our previous exercise, we tackled the different parts and types of multi-tester. Multi-tester is the basic instrument of electronics which combines the three functions. Voltmeter, used to measure voltage, ohmmeter, used to measure resistance, and milliameter, used to measure small amount of AC current and DC current. There are two types of multi-testers, the analog multimeter or multi-testers or VUM, which has identified by a needle that moves on the scale indicating the value of the measured quantity. The other one is the digital multimeter or multi-tester or VUM. is identified mainly by numeric display in order to read and measure values. Parts of multimeter, multi-tester or VUM. First, pointer 
or needle. A needle shaped rod that moves over the scale of a meter. It is mechanically connected to the moving coil. It indicates the measured values on the multi-tester scale. Second, wrench selector knob makes it possible to select different functions and range of the meter. Third, adjustment screw make it possible to adjust the pointer to the zero position of the screw. Fourth, test screw positive for the red color and negative for the black color used to connect the circuit to the electronic component being tested. Fifth, scale. A series of markings used for reading the value of a particular thing to be measured like components, wires connected in a circuit, outlets, etc. All is used in analog multimeter. Have different types of scale for voltage and current reading. The scales have mostly linear, which mean equal division. For resistance, it has separate scale that only be used in finding resistance of a component. Six, digital screen. For digital multimeter or multi-tester DUM, where measurement readouts can be viewed. Now, I will show you the procedure on how to use the multi-tester. While listening, you may follow me as long as your materials are available. If not yet available for the meantime, please observe while I'm doing the demonstration on how to use the multi-tester because you are expected to apply all the knowledge and skills in using it. And I know you can do it. Okay, this is a digital multi-tester. Okay, we have the power button and we have the hold button, okay? So in a power button, you can see the number will be will appear. Then we have this selections we have for the ohm, ohms for measuring the ohms resistance. We have the voltmeter for DC. We have the voltmeter for AC and the milliameter for AC and the milliameter for the DC. So if you're going to move the button you will see the changes of the point okay then we have the tester for the transistors and this is the tester for the capacitor then we have this test proof this is the test proof we have the black for the negative and we have the red for positive positive Okay, we're going to put the black in the common ground and we're going to put the red or the positive to the other side. Okay. So that's all for the digital multimeter uh, demonstration. Now we are done. The Radio Z Escuela program of the Division of Davao de Oro is being brought to you by Nueda Builders Construction and Supply Incorporated, Maverick Builders Incorporated, Mitch Construction and Supply, Arquicons Architectural Construction and Supply, DB Construction and Supply, Hanaway Builders Corporation, Phoenix Corvada Tagum Gasoline Station, Master Construction and Supplies. Mackenzie Builders, GP&H Construction Incorporated, Metro Gear Construction Corporation, NEN Builders and Development Services Corporation, Max Maze Enterprises Incorporated, We Inc. Construction Company, Rangai Construction and Supply, East Sussex Enterprise, WM Construction, Councilor Boogie and Miss Marjorie Vertodazo, Icon Builders and Supply, and Apex Mining Company Incorporated.
at this time we will have your post test to assess what you have learned from our lesson today directions identify the parts of the multi-tester based on the given functions write your answers on your test notebook I will read the question twice before you can write your answers first question to select different functions and range of the meter to select different functions and range of the meter Time's up. The correct answer is Range Selector Nav Second question It indicates the measure values on the multi-tester scale Second question It indicates the measure values on the multi-tester scale Time's up the answer is pointer needle. Third question. Identify by a needle that moves on a scale indicating the value of the measured quantity. Again. Identify by a needle that moves on a scale indicating the value of the measured quantity. Up. The answer is analog multimeter or multi-tester or the VUM. Fourth question. Used in the measurement of small amount of easy current or DC current. Again, used in the measurement of a small amount of easy current or DC current. The answer is digital multi-tester. Fifth question. Identified mainly by numeric display in order to read the measure's value. Time's up. The answer is digital multimeter or multi-tester VUM. Sixth question. Where measurement readouts can be viewed. Again, where measurement readouts can be viewed. Time's up. The answer is digital screen. Seventh question. Makes it possible to adjust the pointer to the zero position of the screw. Again, Makes it possible to adjust the pointer to the zero position of the screw. Time's up. The answer is adjustment screw. Eight questions. Only sees in analog multimeter. Again, only sees in analog multimeter. The answer is scale. Ninth question. A needle shape rod that moves over the scale of a meter. Again. A needle shape rod that moves over the scale of a meter. Up. The answer is pointer or needle. Tenth question. It has different types of scale for voltage and current reading scales have mostly linear which mean equal division. Time's up! The answer is analog multimeter scale. Now, check and count the number of the correct answers. 
Write your score in the upper right portion of your test notebook. Good job, learners! You did it! The Rajo Zispela program of the Division of Davao de Oro is being brought to you by Nueda Builders Construction and Supply Incorporated, Maverick Builders Incorporated, Mitch Construction and Supply, Arkikons Architectural Construction and Supply, DB Construction and Supply, Panaway Builders Corporation, Phoenix Corvada Tagum Gasoline Station, Master Construction and Supplies, Mackenzie Builders, GP and H Construction Incorporated, Metro Gear Construction Corporation, NEN Builders and Development Services Corporation, Max Maze Enterprises Incorporated, We In Construction Company, Rangai Construction and Supply, East Sussex Enterprise, WM Construction, Councillor Boogie and Miss Marjorie Vertodazo, Icon Builders and Supply and Apex Mining Company Incorporated. Let us check if we hit our objective for today. At the end of this episode, first, Enumerate the parts and types of multi-tester. Second, perform how to use multi-tester. Third, value the importance of multi-tester in learning electronics. Great job, everyone! Thank you for tuning in. And a job well done, everyone! Please don't forget to submit all your outputs during the scheduled retrieval and distribution of modules. Thank you so much. Once again, this is teacher Brian G. Panimbim, leaving your code. Never stop learning because life will not stop teaching. Till next time, bye. Rajas Escuela Executive and Technical Working Committee. The school's division superintendent, Yofemia T. Gamutin Seso 5. Assistant Schools Division Superintendent, Dr. Romel R. Handayan. Curriculum Implementation Division OIC Chief, Dr. Arlene B. Lim. School Governance and Operations Division, Dr. Ruben J. Riponte. Program Director, Dr. Arlene B. Lim. Assistant Program Director, Noemi P. Canales. Members, Cecilia Morales, Dr. Hilda A. Opeña, Dr. L. Decrees B. Calzadora, Dr. Dexter A. Sikinia, Nohara O. Pinute, Dr. Grace D. Pontilias, Dr. Renato M. Pakpakin, Dr. Andy P. Cabodoc, Juanito Lapiceros, Engineer Norberto S. Manlangi, Ryan Villanueva, Jomar M. Dumupoy, Bob Daylan S. Milabat, Medard D. Api and Paz Eugenia Villusino. Technical Working Committee Production and Communications Lori Lee E. Quijano Given G. Hinampas Judilan T. U Donna D. T. Bolivar Mary Rose N. Resma Riven C. Manuel Irene Lea C. Manguhon and Bessie Aya N. Banyas Social Media and Packaging Team Christian Anhara L. Martesho, William R. Ranara, Joan T. Iscoton, Roberto S. Acusar Jr., May B. Istanyol, Richard H. Arellano, Ralph A. Tabanyag, Angelo C. Gutierrez Jr., Jade Karen R. Arais, Alisa May Garsuta, Sedi S. Caballero, and Jane S. Caballero. Saraj Ziskwala, Ziguradong Masaya, right and only here at Z Radio 88.5, ang istasyong Ziguradong Lingao, Ziguradong Kuyao.